الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله All praise is due to Allah and peace and blessings be on the last and final messenger of Allah Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam I as a person who entered new in Islam my journey towards Islam started in 2003 when in search of god and in search of truth why i had questions why muslims claim that they are only true i wanted to read quran to find out what are the things which are written in quran which are mentioned in quran which are against my religion that was hinduism at that time when i read quran in 2003 at that time i was a teacher in high school level for science i got time during my summer vacation holidays and uh, i started learning quran at that time after learning quran when i read surah rahman i actually found out the answer of my question who is god because usually people say there is no god every one is god every religion is true i actually wanted to find out which one is actually true and i got my answer from there even though i understood and i left many practices which i used to do as a hindu i didn't accept islam completely or officially i wanted to learn i wanted to know why there are conflicts in the behavior of of so called muslims and the teachings of quran i actually found out some when i pointed out to people that quran teaches something else and you are doing something else they said no no that is mentioned in hadiths i tried to learn hadith from someone but they said that first become muslim then learn hadith so i didn't get the chance to learn hadith from there alhamdulillah when i went to qatar in 2005 i got that chance for one and half years i studied hadith and different lectures of dr bilal flips dr jaki nag and many more scholars dr jamal badwi I was also approached by some Christian brothers who took me to church to pray and they prayed for me they cried for me I also cried along with them But even though they were trying to convince me after learning these lectures I was fully convinced that Islam is incomparable It is the only true religion And I accepted Islam officially in 2006 but the hunger for knowledge was not over as a student of science as a teacher of science there was a habit to ask why how and until i am fully satisfied my hunger would not go so i continued my learning my study whenever i got chance i continued my study and at that time in 2008 i got a golden golden opportunity when i was selected as a dai in qatar guest center qatar my head was dr bilal flips along with doing dawa to my non muslim brothers nepali non muslim brothers i got whenever i got chance if i have a 5 minute break i used to go to dr bilal's table and ask doctor sheikh why this why that and he was always there to actually answer my question he never said no i don't have time ask me later and this relation with dr bilal flips grew with time he became my mentor and my teacher my guide along the way along the journey of finding the authentic islamic knowledge but even though when i was getting means uh, i was doing on official study it was uh, unsystematic 
I wanted to learn Islam systematically. I wanted to know what alims know. What do they really they study? How they become scholars? I wanted to know that. And it was not possible because I was doing my job. I had a home to look after. And I couldn't go to Medina or uh, Saudi because my age was also over to be admitted there. So I thought that I will never get that chance. But Dr. Bilal Flips, when he established Islamic Online University in 2010, I was among the first few people who got admitted to that university. Actually, we thought that this is the golden chance. If we miss it, we will fail. Until then, Islamic Online University was not uh, uh, attested with any university. It was not uh, uh, doing any memorandum of understanding with anyone. We just entered there so that the teachers can teach us and we can learn. And Alhamdulillah, along with my, uh, along the journey which I was for four years in Islamic Online University, I learned from great scholars, good scholars. Most of them PhD holders from Medina or from uh, they were master's degree at least they were master's degree from Medina or Rikhna University. So the knowledge which I got from there, it was really I can mention that yes that was a knowledge. That really mean knowledge. Now I can actually answer some of the queries when I come in contact with, a, uh, with an atheist or with a Christian or with a Hindu or Buddhist. They ask a lot of questions which cannot be answered if I do not know sufficiently about Islam. I wanted to know, I, yeah, after I read Quran, I knew that there is Allah who is looking after us. But the question arises, why He sent us? What is our purpose of life? Why only Muslims? Why only Islam? <coughs> These questions could not be answered before I was admitted to Islamic Online University. We also say that Islam is not a religion but the complete code of life. Allah Ta'ala has described Islam in Quran as Deen, the way. But why Islam is complete code of life? Because in modern days we talk about economics, finance, banking, psychology, sociology, international relations, politics. How Islam, which was revealed 1400 years ago, is still good for people, a guidance for people, a guidance for mankind of the world. Islam is not only for Muslims, as many people think. Islam is the guidance for whole humankind. When Allah Ta'ala says in Quran, Shahrul Ramdan, Unzila Fihil Quran, Hudal Lin Nasi. In the month of Ramadan, Allah says, in the month of Ramadan, this Quran is revealed, which is the guidance for mankind, and the proof is there. And Furqan, the thing which differentiates between right and wrong, is there for whole humankind. During the course, we studied. The subjects which are known as modern but with Islamic touch. We learned psychology but Islamic psychology. We learned banking and finance but Islamic banking and finance and economics. We learned teaching methodology but Islamic teaching methodology. Along with the conventional teachings which were, is done for alims, aqida, fiqh, sira, hadith. And now, alhamdulillah, the whole education which I have found in Islamic Online University, 
it is doing good for me as i have said it is actually helping me to answer the queries of non muslim brothers and actually prove that islam is really the complete way of life a guidance to whole human kind i want to give dua to dr bilal flips who has established this university and my teachers who had dedicated their time to teachers all the facilitators which were there during the online sessions who were checking our assignments and giving us marks and comments good comments actually well done mashallah i want to thank all those proctors which were present during my examination and they helped me even at night even at 11 or 12 o'clock when i was giving examination i was always late due to my dawa works i was always late exam giver and that's why probably i didn't secure that much mark which uh, i was expecting but alhamdulillah all those people it is uh, to all those people it is my dua from the core of my heart that may allah give baraka to those people and may allah makes this islamic online university grow much and much larger as at this time there are more than 150000 students in islamic online university from 219 countries so i hope that these centers these countries increase more and more and we people on this earth we muslims on this earth get chance to actually learn the authentic islamic knowledge actually gain this islamic uh, authentic islamic knowledge and so that we can do dawa to our non muslim brothers and sisters and guide them towards islam jazakallah khair for everyone who is present here and uh, who is listening me at the time may allah bless all of you assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh